Uh, my answer is that, uh, you know, uh, even ma when matters are under investigation, uh, if uh, the concerned want to meet uh, the director and to make a representation uh, on, on their behalf, uh, it is normally granted, but always in the office. And uh, such meetings are better avoided in the residence because it will lead to unnecessary speculation and allegations. So my instructions during my time to officers is do not meet the accused or anyone on their behalf in the residence. And uh, even when they come to the office, uh, it will be on uh, time and date fixed in advance. And such visits also, uh, inter interviews also are not granted very often. But ultimately, it's left to the officer concerned to decide. But if the question is whether it's proper to meet such people in the residence, I would say, uh, by way of abundant caution, such meetings should be avoided because it will result in unnecessary speculation and allegations. So that's my personal point of view. I don't know what is happening in the Supreme Court and what allegations have been made in this particular case.